Hey guys, Miglena here from thepoledancer.com. This is my 7th one mini tutorial from the series 15 spins into climbing. And today I'm going to show you a spin that I saw one of my favorite pole dancers doing, Luis Rafsinska. I immediately fell in love with it and I had to try it out right on the spot. Only from watching, I couldn't understand how can she spin backwards and end up spinning forwards because I couldn't notice any transition. It looks so smooth. I was like, what's going on there? But once I figured out the natural movement of the legs and the hips, it felt like second nature. This is why I love this spin so much. It feels so natural. I broke it down for you in this video so you don't have to wonder like I used to. Also make sure to subscribe to my email list on thepoledancer.com if you want to learn more spins into climbing. This is what the pole skating spin looks like. It uses the same push and pull technique from the previous tutorials. Stand sideways to the pole, outside arm is on the top and pulls down, while inside forearm pushes against the pole. Open the outside leg to the back and inside leg to the front and hold for 2 seconds. To spin backwards from here, swing the outside leg to the back and look over your inside shoulder. To transition into a forward spin, let the inside leg slide back and the hips face the pole. Bend the legs and step in front in spin direction. Notice that as soon as the hips open in spin direction, the outside leg becomes an inside leg and vice versa. In the final spin, we are basically changing legs. Watch this. The inside leg slides back and the outside leg slides in front in spin direction. To make it look fluid, relax your legs and let them naturally slide beneath you. Also pay attention to keep a contact with the floor all the time. To climb, slide the back leg in front and lift your legs. Now it's your turn. Share your own combo including the spin.